Hi YouTube Divas, it's Mahogany, and I know it's been some time. Yes, it has been some time. Some time has bypassed. Yes, it has. And I just want to say to my sister, Mama Love Wigs, to my sister Black Diva 38, she go by another name. However, I haven't, I haven't met, you know, registered in my score yet, but that's my girl Black Diva 38. And I want to say to, um... Oh, I have a sister that's on my page, and her name is F-A-U something. And I just inboxed her and told her that she needs to leave me her number. I want to say you are a fabulous person. You always on my page. You always giving me mad love and support and respect. The utmost respect come from you. And Fat and Fierce, please contact me, inbox me, because I'm just seeing the video, the blog that you did on me on um, 2011. And one of the girlfriends of mine that I work with said, girl, 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 do you know you're on um, somebody's blog? And I never knew how to you know, visit the channel to see the blog. And I must say, Fat and Furious, I love you. I want to say thank you. I love all of the words. I strolled and I read it and I, I emailed it and sent it to a lot of um my friends. I just want to say thank you. But I'm going to come to you all today because I've been missing in action. And when I say missing in action, I've been holding out three fucking jobs. Yeah. So what I did... Because I got so fed up with sleeping, sleeping, sleeping. And I know a bitch like me can't get pregnant. I had to check myself. And what it was, I was overwhelmed with work. 16-hour shifts four times a day. I mean, four times a week, my mistake. And it was burning me out. But I'm going to come and do some wig tutorials for y'all. Because I have been shopping and shopping and ordering and was unable to do my tutorials. So, I want to say to you you all, I apologize for being missing in action. I got a, cup, um, a couple of inboxes asking, like, where are you? Okay, so today I want to do a video on, this is some um, Malaysian hair. Yeah, and I bought it, and I had got it sold in. And what I did, I had took it out in numbers. I numbered it as I was taking it out. And last night, I made it into a wig. It has the closure. At the top, but I'm about to do another wig tutorial. But I just wanted to come to you all and let you all know that I'm safe and I'm sound and I'm humble and I'm fine. And uh, I'm about to do some wig tutorials. Okay, I'm going to take this one off. Yeah, I made this one. It is raggly. I made this one into a wig. As you can see, this is my, it's on a regular wig cap. It's on a regular wig, um, wig cap. I sold the comb in the back. I sold the comb next to the ear, and I sold the comb next to the other ear, and here's my closure piece. Yeah. I didn't want to um, bond my closure, so I cut the wig in the middle and did the closure piece. So this is my Malaysian wig, and the guy who did my hair, he had dyed it for me, and this is how it turned out, and I really love it. All I do is spray it with water, and it, it, it does what it do. Oh, I don't have my wig cap. Oh, I, I'm so, so sorry. But this is how I wear my hair in, you know, during the process of my wig wearing. Yeah. I feel like something's on my lip. It is. Okay. So, I'm going to start, you all. I went into my local beauty and barber, and I seen this Janet Super Afro wig. Janet Super Afro. And I just had to, I just had to try her. I hope it works out. But first of all, let me put this on. I have been, um, my girl Exanta, she had came to D.C. Um, on business and stopped by my house. She came to my home. We, um, we, we had a nice time. And if you all don't know of Exanta, and I'm Exanta Design, she's on my Facebook page. And here's her, um, her, her, um, name. And this is a piece of her jewelry that I bought. And this is how you apply it. I'm going to do the video with one of her necklaces on. You can, you know, put it however you want it. Okay, but I'm going to do the video on the Janet um, Super Afro wig. Wow, she's huge. She's huge. Okay. She's not a lace front. However, adjustable tabs are in the back. Already adjusted. And she's not a lace front. That's how it looks in the front. And I'm um, great to apply her. Y'all know y'all gonna say, uh-uh, I'm a hug me. You're doing it wrong. My wig cap is in the bathroom, so I don't want to walk off and leave you all. I've been gone too long. This is the super afro. 
Oh, shit. Damn. I thought the fucking Drew wig was out of this fucking world. God damn. And I just took this out of the pack. And this is the super, oh my freaking God. This is the super Afro wig, y'all. Oh my God, she's beautiful. Right out of the pack. Oh my God. I think I'll do her just like this with a part. She is fabulous. Oh my God, you all. I should have put some hoops on. But look at her. God damn. Oh my God. I am feeling Pam Gria. I love it. I love it. And this is how she looks on the mannequin. Oh my God. Oh my God. Look. You could do so much with her. And I didn't do anything. No water. No nothing. I bought my little water bottle thinking I was going to need it. Mm -mm. Oh my God. This wig reminds me of the Drew wig because when you take the Drew wig out of the box, you can basically just do anything to the Drew wig. And this has body, y'all. Oh my God. It is so beautiful. It puts you in the mind of the Drew wig. It puts you in the mind of the, um, the, uh, damn, it's another one by Bishi called it the champagne or something. But this is just so beautiful. And I love hair off of my face. This is pretty. This is really pretty. Really, really pretty. Y'all see, I just took it out of the box and put it on. Yeah, I like her. It's beautiful. And I want to say to you all that um, I have tons and tons and tons of vids that I need to do. However, um, and I'm going to show you all, matter of fact, come take a walk. Come take a wig walk. Come take a wig walk. As you can see, all those wigs I've been ordering. And then they down here on the floor, all up in the cut. So it's tons and tons of wigs. And I'm going to keep it real because most of them motherfuckers get on YouTube. And they don't keep it 100 for y'all sisters. And that's the only thing I don't like. Because you view the videos and you're looking for the videos for encouragement and style. And charisma. And a lot of these divas. Yeah, I'm going to give them that much credit. If the shoe fit, fucking wear it. My size is a seven and a half. So I'm giving this message out there. And just keeping it 100 as possible. No, I'm the first to tell you I'm not perfect. However, these, these divas. Wig divas. Get on YouTube. Face fully made up. And do these videos. And the first thing you see when you read. The description bar is that they purchased at their local B, B, um, BSS or whatever, Beauty and Barber. Okay, that could be so well and fine. But the ones out there that's getting these wigs and you're doing these tutorials and people are, these wig companies are sending you the wigs. There's other sisters out there that's not as fortunate as us that could use that just a little help. And when they inbox you asking you the whereabouts of how to... Um, Network and merge with a company to support their wigs, knowing that all of us are just one big happy family on YouTube. Give them some information. Don't be fake nor phony. Give them the information that they are seeking for. Their sisters, you know, out here that needs their help. They're sitting home um, by choice. They sit home by choice, and they love doing videos. They they love doing videos better than me or even you. That can rock these wigs, and and I'd rather support them than support the the in, the the artificial ones. So I'm just saying, if it's anybody out there, even down to myself, but I buy all of my wigs. But what I have been doing was recycling. I I was at work, and it was an older lady there that could use the wigs, and I gave her her bag of wigs. So every now and then, I'll be doing a video stating that I'm gonna do a wig giveaway. I don't have a mind giving a wig away. So um. I just want, you know, sisters out there to know, let's do some encouraging and some supporting and help others out. There's a lot of us out here that love wigs that need to wear them for medical purposes or just want to wear them just to alternate or, you know, redo their fashion statement, want to be sexy for their man. Help them out. If you know that there's a wig company out there that needs some more support from females, inbox or even if they ask you, Give them that um, words of encouragement to help them and guide them there. They're not going to outdo you. They just might do well. 
Yeah. So um, I just wanted to put that out there because it irritates me that sisters don't help one another. But I'm going to get back to the video because I done took this somewhere totally out of this world. So I just want to say that I'm rocking the Janet Wig Super Afro in the color number one. And I purchased this wig on my own. And it was $22 from Ebony line.com just google www.janet super afro wig and i think like three sites will come up stating that they have this wig this wig is no more than 22 dollars i bought two yeah i bought two so i'm coming back with another wig tutorial i want to say thank you for my supporters thank you for my subscribers and thank you for my sisters i love you all and goodbye